Do you got a flat line to get a little help around here? Do you got to move to Canada to get some decent medical care? Uh, they'll be right here. So, uh, uh, 50 grand, huh? Boy, I don't, I don't know, uh, how I could afford that. You know, unless I came into some money, you know, a, an inheritance or, or something. There's no money, Alan. None? The whole thing's a house of cards. <laughs> Okay, I do not want to have to do this, but I am Matthew Broderick. And that is my brother lying there. I am so sorry, Mr. Broderick. I love you and the princess. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's have a look, see. Huh? According to your test, you just had an acute attack of indigestion. <sighs> it was gas? Yeah, it's a big bubble, about the size of a pomegranate. <laughs> What have you had to eat recently? Nothing much. We had Belgian waffles, link sausages, two Red Bulls, a quart of scotch, and the tongue of a 24-year-old actress. He asked what I ate, Alan. And I told him, Charlie. Oh, you're a dirty bird. But the good news is that you are a perfectly healthy 50-year-old man. I'm only 40. Tell that to your liver. I would recommend you slow down a bit. Stop. I've been saying the same thing. And you? Why no sequel to Ferris Bueller, huh? Wait and I wait. Uh, I'm sorry, I'll, I'll get on it. Ah, give the people what they want. So, gas. <laughs> Good news, huh? A little embarrassing, but yeah. What do you have to be embarrassed about? Oh, I don't know. Paramedics, the ambulance, the crying in the last minute negotiations with God. 